Have you ever wondered what the science is behind airplane and helicopter flight? Then watch this. Aerodynamics can seem tricky, but we're here to simplify it. All right, let's dive in. An airfoil is the shape of a wing or blade that creates lift. This first effect called the coander effect makes air stick to the curved surface of the wing, causing the air leaving the back of the airfoil to angle downwards, thus producing thrust upwards against gravity. Now, the second effect is Bernoulli's principle. It says that as the velocity of the air increases, the pressure must decrease. So, air moving over the top of the airfoil speeds up due to the coander effect, thus creating a lower pressure pulling upward on the airfoil, lifting the aircraft. Newton's third law then tells us that for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. So, as the wing pushes air down, the air pushes the wing up. There are two types of airfoils, symmetrical and asymmetrical. Symmetrical ones are the same on both sides, great for allowing zero lift to be produced, even when the airfoil is moving through the air. Asymmetrical ones have a flatter bottom and curved top, perfect for stable lift as velocity increases. So what about the lift equation? Lift equals the coefficient of lift, times air density, times velocity squared, times wing area divided by 2. So next time you see an aircraft you'll know the science keeping it in the air. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe.